Okay, in this one, we're going to add a picture to a background. All right, for example, we would go into, well, you'll have to find whatever picture you want. And then you take it and go to PixArt and you just put it in a circle. I'm just going to see what, if I, what I have on here. Here we'll use Ellen and her boyfriend because I'm doing one for her. I just pin, pull this picture and go to tool, shape, circle, and then put them in there. And there you have them in their pretty little circle. And save it. Okay. And then next, we're going to edit again. Edit. And find what kind of circle I want to put them in. Now this you could just add to an atlas if you wanted to. You could pull up your sample atlas. But let's put them in here just to see how they would look. Let's edit it. And then at the bottom it says add photo. Okay, let's see. Add photo. And we're going to add this one. And if you see that gray around it, that means I've already made it into a circle. It makes it even better. And there they are. And let's just stretch them. And boom. And you have a photo added onto the circle for the atlas. Simple as that. Save it. Now, if you want to put it on how everybody's putting, you know, to post it, just go and find your little samples they gave you that look like the necklaces. But you can see here where I did some little feet and a curve of the name and the letters. I love that one for my friend. I'm ordering that one for her. Let's see, I got done. I've been playing with them a lot. Whoops. Okay, here we'll use this. There we go. And then you would just take it, edit, add photo at the bottom, pick them. And you can do it this way too. Or any one you've added. Boom. There you go. Hope that helps. You can also, I'll show you another one. Find a background you like. Here's one. Add photo. See how I haven't cut that one off, so I don't want to use that one. You gotta have, if it has gray around it, it means you've already trimmed it. If you have not made it into that circle, it just won't fit. It won't do it that way. I can't remember now which ones I've done and which ones I haven't because my eyes are getting tired. Wow, my dog snores really loud. But you get the gist on that one. You just, once you've in PixArt circle cropped it, then you can add it on because it has to be circle cropped. Otherwise, you're going to have this little, as you've seen in those pictures, I think this one's still going to have it. Do, do, do. He obviously doesn't like this picture, does it? You have to always trim it into the circle, or it's going to have the square. It's always going to have the little squares. See how this has the black around it? If you don't go into PixArt to, to crop that out, and then use the one you've cropped, you're always going to have this. So I hope this one helps.